hello viewers i welcome you all from HRTF tech channel uh, today we are going to see how we can upgrade our dynamic crm uh, 9.0 environment to 9.1 as we all know that uh, microsoft has on its uh, support website has uh, given you uh, updates regarding uh, 9.1 version and also as 9.0 version uh, in order to upgrade uh, our environment to 9.1 it is uh, very important that your 9.0.x version should be uh, updated to the latest version and then you can uh, consequently update it to the latest version of uh, 9.1 okay so uh, these are important points and they are already uh, mentioned in uh, microsoft sport website that always apply the most recent update applying an older 9.1 update on a computer with a later 9.0 version will result in failures okay uh, due to some assemblies not loading correctly if your 9.0 deployment is 9.0.47.8 or later version then you must apply the uh, 9.1.20 update or later latest version okay so these are some of the important point points uh, in our previous video I will also describe the link here uh, I have up upgraded my environment to the latest version of this one uh, I can show you here if I go to settings about here you can see that my uh, environment is updated to 9.0.51.6 that is this one now I'm going to upgrade it to the latest version of this one for that purpose i have down uh, i have already downloaded this uh, update and have uh, save it here that is this one in my server now uh, i'm going in my server and i'm going to run it as an administrator make sure it is very important uh, that was i need to tell it at the earlier stage of my video that you must always have uh, backup your server environment before proceeding with the update because uh, if the update hangs or do some malfunction it may result in the uh, system failure so always and always it's a best practice to take backup of your environment before proceeding with the update installation so i have uh, extracting files once the files are extracted uh, the dynamics update is ready to be installed click on next and accept the license agreement click on install and the installation will start and it will take few minutes or even hours depending upon your server uh, hardware uh, availability and resource resources okay viewers uh, it has taken about uh, almost uh, two to three hours and uh, the dynamics 365 server update has been completed successfully and uh, restart is required so let's restart the server once the server has been restarted we will go <coughs> we will browse our uh, CRM app okay now our environment has been upgraded to uh, nine version 9.1 uh, let me show you here okay now here you can see that the version uh, updated is 9.1.30.9 with a database version of 9.1.30.9 on premise okay so uh, this is the same version that is the latest version available let me show you here 9.1.30.9 uh, this is the latest version of 9.1 that was uh, released on July 2024 uh, with this article number and if I click here 
you can see that uh, these are fun, uh, some of the uh, important prepared functionality that were introduced in this uh, update that is unnatural translation for add more records on call to form disable auto publish of packages for on premise in app for outlook fix issues with unsigned third party dll google dot proto buff dot dll accessibility fixes and security fixes so this is the version and this is the same version that is this one okay so in this way you can update or upgrade your uh, dynamics uh, crm environment from 9.0 to 9.1 version so viewers i thank you all for watching this video and uh, subscribe my channel and enjoy watching more more videos i thank you all